Good morning, Benito's Ghetto Ass Floor Repair Service, where you can get your floor rigged so you don't bust your shit. Uh, yeah, I'd like to make an appointment, please. Okay, you need an appointment? Yeah, I have a carpet fix. You do carpet? Yes, we do. Uh, how soon can you get somebody out? It'll be about 10 minutes. 10 minutes? That fast? Yes, sir, 10 minutes. Okay, uh, 330 Georgetown Square, Suite 104. And, okay, hold, uh, get, hold on a moment, hold on a moment. All right. Benito's Floor Repair Service, how can I help you? I, I don't give a fuck about your floor. So what? Find somebody else to fix it then. Hello, how can I help you? Yeah, is, I've been holding. Is this uh, Benito's Ghetto Ass Floor yes, uh, Repair Service? We'll be there in 10 minutes, sir. 10 minutes? 10 minutes. Would you send Benito himself? I hear he does real good work. Yeah, I'll let him know. All right, well, thank you. No problem. Have a Goodbye. Good Boy, it's a tough morning, huh? Glad everybody's out here. Hey, did Benito call about uh, fixing that carpet? Not yet, actually. Okay. Tom's phone, how can I help you? Oh, hey, Benito. Uh, you know, Tom's not available right now. He's actually on another line. Hey, Tom, Benito just called. Is he on the phone? Yeah. Okay, tell him to get here and get this carpet fixed. I got to get going. All right. Hey, Benito. Tom says to hurry up, bro. Ah, uh, you'll be here? All right. Bye. Oh, hey, what's up, Benito? Oh, yeah, look, I'm going to show you where, where the uh, carpet needs to be fixed up. All right, yeah, Benito. Look, it's right here. How long do you think it'll take you to uh, to get this done? A couple minutes? Ten minutes. All right, cool. For the Did he start working yet? Yeah, I think he's done it. What the hell does he need a hammer for? I have no idea, bro. I guess whatever it takes to get the work done, bro. Jesus. I don't know that. I haven't done that much carpet repair, but I never had it. I think he's almost, he's about done, bro. Jesus. I think so, bro. I don't know. I don't hear any more noises. Hello. Go, go see what he's doing. All right, let me go check it out. Alright, go see if he's done. Alright, let's go check it out, bro. I hope this look better look better than what it sounded like. Oh look! What the hell? <laughs> I think he's done. <laughs> it looks worse. Man, I told you, don't call Benito in his ghetto ass floor repair service. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. You guys, pick up 200. God, this place is really getting on my nerves. Where the hell is 200, the phone's ringing. Man, it's after, it's a minute after eight. Where the hell's Laura Lou at? Pick up 200. Hi, guys. Boy, that wire gets on my damn nerves. You guys took up 200. Man, that's all I hear is 2D. 2D is 2. Where the hell's Laura? It's a minute after 8, man. She's going to get Dwyer in a bad mood. 
Hey, good oh. afternoon, Laura. Hi. I'm hey, good afternoon, Laura. Laura. I'm good so afternoon. sorry. Man, you got wires pissed off, man. Okay. Yeah. He's so anal. I know, but man, you're gonna get him in a bad mood. What's new? All right, here he comes. Laura, where you been? It's two minutes after eight. Oh, I won't. I ran. There he goes again. Yeah. I got an incoming. Okay. I know, ma'am. Yeah. Ma'am, 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 ma'am. Stop. Stop. Okay, I can't even hear you. You just... All right, whatever. Goodbye. Now, here comes Squire. Here he comes. Laura, what happened to that call? Um, All I hear is ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Hey, huh? Don't even give me a chance to say anything. Okay. Man, I'm really glad you moved Laura Lou out of there, man. All she does is complain about how anal you are. I am anal. She go. <laughs> I love Laura Lou. We're such wonderful friends. But then again, in my age, that's all Laura Lou and I can be as friends. Oh! All right. Say the uh, you're gonna run out and grab another smoke. I love Lou. I love when she's not around. How come? I'll run out and grab another smoke. <laughs> All right. Five, Five eight, 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 two, three hundred. Empire today. <laughs> See, Allison likes that because she wears out the carpet. Go to the bathroom and that. Yeah. See, she wears out the carpet walking aimlessly to the lady. So when she hears a, a commercial about new carpet, it just motivates her. <laughs> Shot Alice, it's 40 bucks. <laughs> my name is Michael Janelle, and my number is 866 Mo, hard at work. Hey, all right. All right, good shots. Good shot, Suzanne, on that $450. Okay. Bam! Oh, Susanna, oh, don't you grapple me. <laughs> Hold on, not yet. All right, now. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, get on the phone, guys. That was Tom. Tom. Oh, uh, look Good job, Benny. <laughs> Benny strong like Incredible Hulk. Well, actually, more like the Incredible Bull. Good job, Benny. You guys standing up. Benny strong like Incredible <laughs> Hulk. <laughs> Well, more like the incredible ball. Hey, you gotta sing it though. Yes, I need to sing. Oh my god. <laughs> you gotta sing it, sing it. Larry? <laughs> Is this Larry Kennedy? Yes, <laughs> I got game, dog. I got game, man. I got game, dog. You know, man, Choco got game, dog. Choco got game. Why? Love that little leaf. Why, Tom? I don't have a clue. <laughs> Dan Dwyer's a hell of a guy. The only thing is, watch for him at the Christmas party, because he's known for his hug of death. Did I ever show you the prettiest picture I have of Little Eve? No, which oh, one? Here, can you see it? Can you zero in? No, oh, man. Isn't she beautiful? That's a ghetto-ass picture, man. Well, she's ghetto-fabulous. <laughs> hey, did you get the part ghetto fad? Well, little buddy. What's up, Doc? There's been an Allison sighting. No, yeah, where? Follow me. Let's see. We're going to have to go and investigate. Uh -huh. I think there's another one too, little buddy. Where? Over here. What do you think? I think that's that. That yeah, that's Allison. She's been here, right? That's evidence. Warned to the. All right, come here. I think there's one more. 
Ah, here. Making the movie. Little buddy. It's right here. Another Alice inside. <laughs> let's, let's take a closer look. What do you Yep. Think? She ran the carpet down there. What really motivates Allison is when we sing 588 five, eight, 300 Empire today. today. Good morning to you, Johnny O'Connolly. I love Johnny O'Connolly. Why, Tom? Well, because he's like me. He's Irish. But what else? Well, because he's Irish like me. And by the way, my name's not Crox anymore. My name's O'Toole. Timothy O'Toole. And I love Johnny O'Connolly. He's got the luck of the Irish, he does. He doesn't need a rabbit's foot or a horseshoe. I bet you he knows where to put the gold is at the end of the rainbow, he does. He's like a big leprechaun. A big, big leprechaun. A fat leprechaun. That's why I love Johnny O'Connolly. Hey, Tom, what's this? Well, I think I'm going to go out and have a smoke. Why? Well, let's see. No smoking within 15 feet of entrance. Yeah, like hmm. Play massive. Yeah. Okay. I love that too. What the heck is going on here? Am I about 15 feet, little buddy? You are. You said you have to be 15 <laughs> feet from the door. <laughs> are you 15 feet away? Yes, sir. You are. Eva helps Tom into the office after his operation. Hurry up! Come on, Tom! Hurry up! Um. <laughs> Ooh, his credit card. <laughs> Shut up, Tom! Shut up? Is that how they teach you kids to talk to teenagers? <laughs> On social security. <laughs> Alright, good shot, big dog Noel. Alright. Good shot, Noel. Alright. Play it again. It's a video. It's a video. 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 <laughs> Just press it. Just press it. All right, evil laugh, Martini. <laughs> you got somebody's money. Tom would always say, me and Laura Lou are the best of friends, but at my age, that's all we could be as friends. What? Last time I yawned was December 4th, 1973. I was getting married for the first time. And why y'all up in my business, my business, my business? Go. Hey Tom, so you're gonna be missed. I'm gonna miss you calling me Tulip, but this one's for you. Damn, Glow has more weaves than a dog in traffic. Also, when he first met my daughter, he found out that she cut my uh, younger son with a box cutter. It's a long story, so I'll make it short. So Croxo asked her, what did you do to your brother? And she said, I cut him. So Croxo made a big thing, so his new thing became, every time he saw my daughter, he would say, hey, what did you do to your brother? I cut him. There is a freeloader, bragger, and bully, but I still love her more than Julie. We have a live one here. Go ahead on. Man. <laughs> Holla, fishing for dollars. All right, you know, when Croxel, you know, met me, we met, you know, he thought I was one of those Jesus freaks. Then he found out I was one of those longer hippie freaks. And I told him, Tom, I'm not a hippie. You know what I mean, hippies are about peace and love, and I'm more about war and hate, so. But I love you, Croxel. Yeah! 
Bounce with me, bounce with me, flip an ounce with me. Yeah, baby, we bout that. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> They're all idiots. <laughs> Something uh, Cox would always say. Do you? Tom used to tell me he always should have whooped your ass when you were a kid. Oh. Cut. All right, cut. 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 All right, cut. 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 All right. Cut. Cut. All right, cut. All right. But for now, it's it still recording. Yeah, it's still recording. Oh Lord, you got to come over here, man. <laughs> cut. All right. Cut. Okay, now we don't want to film him going over there. Those are the no, 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 well, you, you're not screwing us up, no, man. It's hard to find good character actors nowadays.